What's up, YouTube? Reg Fox, if you know me, Star Fox, if you don't, and I'm here with another real review. And you know what we're talking about. We're talking about that Blackberry Classic. You guys wanted it, so here it is. Don't mind me, I'm pouring myself a little bit of scotch. Um, you know, this was a gift. I, I don't know. Do y'all mess with this? Glenn Moray? I don't know what that is, but um, I've never had it. But we don't have it today. So if you guys got a drink with yourselves, you know, have a, have a drink while we talk about this uh, Blackberry Classic. This is the uh, Chilling Balls. We don't use ice no more. We want our drink to be um, as smooth as possible. Happy New Year to everybody out there in the YouTube universe. I hope everybody's still alive, had a safe and happy one. Uh, but without further ado, I'll take a sip and then we, we get to talking about this classic. Now guys, I'm going to try to make this video pretty short. Reason out, reason for that... <sighs> oh man, that's pretty smooth. Uh, reason for that is because you see my, you see my passport. You see my passport um, review, right? So if you've seen the passport, it's the same software. I mean, this is .10.3.1, but it's basically the same software, all right? So the major difference between this and the passport is the size. Look at that. We went over the body, right? I'm going to tell you right now, YouTube, this is hands down, no pun intended with the hands, the best phone I've ever felt in my hand. I mean, it's just a great grip. It feels really, really nice in the hand. Okay? So, if you got small to average hands like I do, this is going to definitely be a, a daily driver for you over the Passport. Now, some people have been asking me the size. This is an iPhone 5. You see, this? it's, it's bigger, it's taller, wider than the iPhone 5. I mean, really, a lot wider, like a whole, than the iPhone 5, right? Anyway, let's put the iPhone to the side. Blackberry pa Classic. What can we talk about? I mean, what can I say that's different than what you already know? All right, how about this? It's slower. Listen to me. YouTube, this shit is slower than the Passport. You want to see an example? This side button right here. All right, let me see if I can get that focused. There we go. That side button acts as the uh, BlackBerry Assistant. So let me launch that. Flashlight. Searching the internet for flashlight. You see what I'm saying? You're not supposed to search the internet for flashlight. You're supposed to just turn on the flashlight. So let's try that again. We're going to do that one more time. Flashlight. Searching the internet for flashlight. All right. Maybe it's me. Maybe I should say turn on the flashlight, right? Let's try it. This is the real review, so we're going to keep it going. We're going to keep it live. Turn on flashlight. Flashlight. All right. You know what, YouTube? That might have been me. That that went pretty fast. Turn off flashlight. Turning off the flashlight. Ah, I mean, now I want to act right. They want to be good now. This shit was really slow before. Before I even did this video, YouTube, the shit was really slow. Um, let's try it one more time. Turn on flashlight. Flashlight. That, that was that was pretty fast. All right, turn off flashlight. <laughs> turn off flashlight. Turning off the flashlight. All right, YouTube. Listen, that that moved pretty fast. Okay, I ain't gonna lie, that moved pretty fast. But it wasn't. It was. It was acting up before. Um, what else can I say about this? I don't want to give you a half-ass review, but honestly, I feel like I went through the um, 
I went through the passport so in depth that there's really nothing I can say about the classic that's different than the passport other than talking about size. That's the only thing I can talk about is the size. Hold on, let's see. Let's go on the web browser. ESPN. Obviously, I've been looking at uh, nudie stuff. you just seen that, right? Anyway. <laughs> I, uh, what website are you going to? Fan Wars. It's moving slow. It's moving slow. Let me do that one more time. I'm going to... I'm going to do it off the camera because I'm trying to do this. I can hear. I can hear the comments right now. Reg Fox, you slipping. You slipping on this one. It's not it's not moving right. Anyway, we're back, right? So only thing I can talk about is the difference in size. The difference in speed. The passport is a faster phone. Now, I know this is not a comparison. This is about, I like that where you could, um, can y'all see that? Let me see if I can move that closer. The trackpad is decent. Actually, it's better than decent. It's, it's really good. It's very, um, it moves. I can't see that. It, it moves, it moves. Um, it moves. Alright, and you got the the black background inside the text, which is cool. I like the black backgrounds, right? I like the black background. But I wish the black background would happen in the hub. It's not in the hub. You see? The black background is not in the hub, if you can see that. Right? I mean, I know I'm nitpicking. Also, you see what I'm doing here? I'm trying to flick up. I've noticed some lag in that in that in that flicking up. I know I'm calling it. Listen, YouTube. I don't know what to say about this. Maybe I've had too many drinks already, but. Do I like the phone? Yes. I love the phone. I like the size of the phone. You understand what I'm saying? I like the size of the phone. It can do everything the passport can do, besides, you know, move it having a, a trackpad on the um on the keyboard but you do have your classic trackpad right here right so let me see if i could turn the screen down so you guys can see what's going on here hold on i'm gonna turn the display down but it i don't know if y'all noticed the lag it doesn't move as fast i don't know if i'm tainted by the passport or if it really just moving slower all right, so we're going to put that all the way down. Now you can see the screen. So let's put it all the way to the slowest form. But there's lag. There is lag. I mean, not when you're scrolling. No, but let's see. Let's open uh, Crackberry. All right. I know it's not showing the lag right now. But look, look what's happening here. I'm touching the trackpad. There we go, okay. All right now it wants to work. It just feels a little buggy. I, I'll be honest with you guys. It feels a little buggy. The uh, passport, straight out the box, straight out the box, it was smooth. It was crispy. This obviously has slower memory and stuff like that. But look, did you did you see that? I had to. It's not it's not doing it as fast. Look, oh it doesn't do that. It's not doing it as fast. Ah, man, YouTube, I feel like I'm messing this video up. We already nine minutes in, but I'm going to keep it going. Um, let's take a look at a video. Look how, look how long it's taking to load up YouTube. That wasn't long at all, but I feel like it was pretty long. Like, let's just, let's see. Let's click on something here. Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Ken, and welcome to my review. Obviously, this is as big as the screen is going to get. Pro 8.4. So this is definitely one of the best. It leaves small something size to be desired. Size tablet you can get. It leaves something to be desired, right? So let's go into the to the App Store. Let's see if they render fast. Look how long it's taken to get into the App Store. Did you see that? <sighs> YouTube. It's just, I don't know if I'm tainted by 
you know, it just feels slow. It, it really does. It really feels slow. Let, let's download this app real quick. Get that. I like the phone. I really like the phone. But I like the I like the size of the phone. I like the convenience, the pocketability of the phone. I like the handheld grip. It feels great in your ear. The call quality is great. It feels amazing, but I cannot help but notice how slow the phone moves. I'm still installing an app. It's 2015. It's 2015. Look at this. It should not take this long. That was too long. Okay, look the I don't did anybody do a time check on that? Yo, clock me. Can y'all clock me? Look, it's still installing. I'm gonna shut up. This is painful. <sighs> it shouldn't take this long to install an app. Okay, now now you want me to open. Great, thank you, but you took way too long. It's a great phone, but you should have gave it the bot. You should have gave it the horsepower that the passport has blackberry you messed up on the speed on that okay you messed up on the speed on that now yes granted blackberry wants people to get out of the 9900 and come to this phone will you notice any lag no you won't notice any lag because you're coming from a significantly slower phone okay from the Q10, will you listen? It has it feels a little slower than the Q10. I'll be honest with you, it does feel a little slower than the Q10. It really does. You see, it's rendering. Look, I haven't seen that in years. I mean, it's not taking a long time, but it should be there. All right, listen, I'm a BlackBerry soldier. Business life, we still live in it. You know, we, 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 we sip scotch now, whatever. Whatever the case may be, we don't use ice no more. But at the end of the day, this phone needs to be a lot faster. Does it? Are the emails cool? Yes. Are they fast? Yes. You know, the trackpad is not the most accurate. Uh... But I like that move. <sighs> All right, I, I, I'm 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 going off track here. Um, YouTube. One of the reasons is I did the BlackBerry Passport, and the OS is so similar that I really don't know what to say as far as the um, you know, the the experience. You've seen it. If you haven't, check out my. My real review of the BlackBerry Passport. You're really going to get in depth on how, you know, what the software is like. You know? You, you, so you're going to get that, that, that feel of the software. So I guess what I need here to tell you guys is classic or passport, right? The answer to that comes from do you like a phone that you can hold that you don't feel... That you can do this and, and get your, you know, your, your Ari from Entourage on and talk with people and wave in your hand and your Blackberries in your hand. as just making you dizzy, you know, but then this is my daily driver. How about I say that? This is my daily driver. And the reason it's my daily driver is because of the size. All right. It's just really that much functional as far as size. The keyboard. Let me talk about the keyboard. The keyboard is awesome. The keyboard is amazing. I mean, I don't want to not talk about the keyboard. The keyboard is amazing. You know? The keyboard is, a, is, is amazing. I, I love this keyboard. It's one of the best keyboards in the business. But a few times I'm flick up, it doesn't flick. I mean, that's just the facts. I mean, you're seeing it flick now. It's doing. It scrolls well, but it takes a minute 
and a half to load and render certain things. Okay? It really does. And it's it's hit or miss with this thing. So it's a great phone, but it needs a lot more horsepower. It needs a lot more power. Um, the speakers are not as loud as the Passport. You know, they're not bad, but they're not as loud as the Passport. Um, I, but I like the phone. Does that make sense? I know I'm rambling right now, but I'm chilling. I'm chilling. It's Friday night. I could be anywhere in the world, but I'm here with you guys. Um, so that be that being said, if y'all don't mind, let, let's um let's go into LinkedIn. Let's open LinkedIn. See how long it takes to open this up. Um, all right, that that moves pretty fast. Maximum downloads of LinkedIn reach. You know, I don't, I don't know what that means. I've never seen that before. All right, but um, look, I'm trying to swing. All right, that's that's all right. Real review. Let's download a video game. Let's do Temple Run because that's what we did on the um, on the passport. So let's see how long it takes to download Temple Run and play Temple Run and see how smooth it goes. All right. I said I was gonna make this short because I didn't really have nothing else to say to you guys. Other than this phone is a, has a great body, a great feel, very, very nice in the hand, solid build, nice weight to it. I admire the hardware of this phone. I'm in love with the hardware of this phone. What happened? Did I just mess it up? You see what I'm saying? I'm in love with the hardware of this phone. The software needs more power. It needs more power. Like Tim Allen would say in Home Improvement. Huh, huh, we need more power. <laughs> YouTube, how, how was y'all New Year's? Did everybody have a good time? Did everybody chill? While we wait for this thing to load up. This is the Vivis Night um, battery charger. I like it. This was floss approved. Um, we, we, we fucks with floss at the end of the day. Some people seen the shot I threw. Some people caught it. Some people didn't. It was all fun and games. But um, this is definitely something you should have or something like it when you on the go and you need to charge your phone. Speaking of battery life, battery life on this is decent. Um, if you look at it, look, I'm swiping up. My battery life is almost done. Um, it's decent. It's, it's, again, it's not the Passport. So if you guys are thinking, should you go Passport or Classic? I'm going to say, if, if you're the type of person that likes to be seen, likes to be noticed, likes to go all the way, if you're going to do it, you're going to do it big, then it's a no-brainer. The BlackBerry Passport is on par with the Note 4, the Note Edge, the... Six plus, all the big guys, all the you know, all the heavyweights in the game, right? Classic is not a heavyweight, it's junior lightweight, maybe middleweight, possibly. It's not a heavyweight, but I guarantee I think that it's gonna be the phone that's it's gonna be your workhorse, even though it moves slow, it's brand new. Get the bugs out of it, you know. We're gonna wait to see how long this thing loads up. Um, but I, I can see me using this phone for another, what, year? Year and a half, maybe. <sighs> it's just... Look, I hear noise. I don't see nothing happening. It shouldn't take this long to open up a video game. I mean, again, we don't play video games, right? But still. Still. This is unacceptable. And I told you guys, I buy these things with my own money. Right, so nobody's paying me. Blackberry has not sent me an email or anything like that. This is unacceptable. No, I don't want to sign in. I want to play the game. Let's play. All right, let's see. Uh huh, uh huh. All right, remember, just like we did before, it's moving. All right. 
and I died. But y'all see, I swiped, right? You seen I swiped? I swiped. Let me see. You're trying to kill me. I swiped. All right, it's moving. Right? It's moving. Hold on. Hold on, wait. Okay. All right. Let's swipe down. Oh! Oh. Y'all play Temple Run? Oh, and I'm dead. Yeah, you, you already know. I died, so. All right, so that was a pretty all right showing. Right? Oh, look. App Store Market. One Mobile Market. Blackberry World. So, hold on. Let me talk my shit a little bit. So, the people who's talking about it ain't got no apps, I got one app store, right? Even though it takes forever to load. But hold on, I'm not done. I got two app stores. Let me see, what, what, what's something that everybody are always doing? Now? What, Snapchat? That's what y'all That's what y'all do now? Hold on. Let's see if that's here. Snapchat. Is that is that Snapchat? Is that what that looks like? I mean, I don't know. I, I never download these things. Come on, focus, 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 focus. Anyway, whatever. So that's two app stores. And then we got the BlackBerry. That's three app stores. So what y'all talking about? Y'all talking about apps? I got three app stores. I got three app stores. Right? I got three app stores. Anyway. I got Vine. Y'all want to do it for the Vine? Let's do it for the Vine. Do it for the Vine. We're going to see some booty shaking videos. Or is that inappropriate? Is that inappropriate? Let me know if that's inappropriate, YouTube. But look, it's taking forever to open Vine up, though. That's not That's not cool. Wait, wait. That's inappropriate. Because I think, I think there's some unacceptable things on there. Right? We got the Twitter. Um, we got Dropbox. I mean, we got everything. Y'all want to take a picture? Let's take a picture. I mean, you're not going to see them. You're not going to see what it look like, but. I mean, that's going to be blurry. This is... Hold on, hold on, hold on, YouTube. Let's do that one more time. Let's take another picture. Eh, it's pretty decent. It's decent. All right. Um, what else? What, what was new about the? Um, oh, okay. I know. It. I think that was in the passport too, though. You know, the ability to um, reply. In the hub. Now that's really convenient. I like that. That is really convenient. Hold on. My payment wasn't processed. Why the fuck my Capital One? We, 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 we got to talk. Anyway. Uh, let's see. That's really convenient to be able to. Um, what's. Hold on. I'm trying to do this behind the camera. One handed. you doing tonight this is a bad showing for texting huh it's a bad showing for the texting world anyway we're gonna have to talk to capital one see what they're talking about <laughs> anyway listen youtube 24 minutes gone in on this and i haven't really told you anything right i haven't told you anything about the phone really um but again all right, keyboard, check. It's amazing. It got look. Let's let me show you something. If I could see this, let's see if I could give it a sec. Give it a sec. Hold on, I don't even know what I'm. Come on, focus. This is why you. This is why we call it the rear view because we don't edit. We don't do none of that shit. We just go ahead. But anyway, what I was trying to show you is that this raised up 
on the edge, but it's really clicky. I like it. All right, you got your menu here. You could do all all the stuff that you do with the with the menu. But you guys know this already. I mean, again, how how many times can we go over the same thing? It is the same software. Basically, the same software, just slower. It's the same software, but slower. So you got to ask yourself: Does size really matter? Right? For me. It does. So the classic will be my daily driver. But we'll, like I was telling my man um, who sent me a, a message. Let's, let's see. Let's see. What's his name? Hold on. Let's see where he's at. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let's find it. He sent me a message. And... Um, Hold on, let me find that off. Let me let me just find that off the camera, so I can actually find it. I was just, I just sent him a message because uh, he asked me about the uh, the hand the hand quality. You know that's another thing YouTube about the um, the hub. Sometimes the thing it gets crowded. Have y'all noticed that? Let me know if y'all noticed that it gets crowded. You can't find what you're looking for. And yeah, I know I can search it, but if I don't know the dude's name. I'm going to search it. Alright. Hold on. I'm going to search YouTube comments. Maybe I would want to see this. So let me search YouTube. Okay, here we go. That's not the one, but whatever. Let's, let's do that. Uh, has... Oh, this is not the one. This is not the dude. Where are you at? We just had a conversation. All right, YouTube. Anyway, I can't find it. But he had asked me a question about when I was going to do the real review. And he asked me a question about, um, you know, do I find it pocketable and do I find it comfortable to be on the... Um, on the Blackberry Classic? And the answer is yes. It's very comfortable. It's very comfortable in the hand. And that's one of the main reasons that it's my daily driver. I mean, I could walk around with it, right? I could walk around with it. I don't fear that it's going to fall. Like, I, I'll, I'll, I'll rock my, my passport when I'm in the house. On a couch, and I just want to, you know, bust out some emails and do some work. Also, check out, you know, whatever is going on in the world on the internet and stuff like that. I'm gonna check out the passport because it's a bigger screen. It's just nice to be able to hit the keys and stuff like that. But, and this is a big Nicki Minaj but, check this out. This is 449 off contract, unlocked, 449. So if you want a budget, this phone is a contender. It's definitely a contender. Look at this. Um, it's going into battery saving mode. I like that. It automatically goes into battery saving mode because the battery is about to die. Uh, it lowers the screen. I already have the screen lowered to its lowest um, point. It lowers the screen. It does all that good stuff, you know, but... Hold on, did I just find it? Hold on, look. We got a we got a new message. Just came up, just popped up. But look how whoa, 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 see? Let me show you something. Look how long it took for me to get that. To I'm gonna click it. See, I missed it. Hold on, let me go out. I just want to show you about the speed is kind of unacceptable. All right? So I'm gonna click out. I'm gonna go into um Now let's see. I'm going to mark it as unread. Alright. So it's unread. Right? Check this out. Uh, it moved fast. Alright, here's my boy. This is the boy I was talking about. Um, he's not a boy. A grown man. Christian B. 
Thanks, bro. You're the man. And oh, I love the sound of that. Has an awesome ring to it. The real classic review. Ponder that for a moment. Great title. Wouldn't you agree? I definitely agree, Christian B. I definitely agree. However, I'm thinking 30 minutes in on this um, review and I was all over the place. I apologize for the tackiness. It is the real classic review. I like the way that sounds. Um, but if you're watching this right now, Christian, you're going to see that I have some gripes about the phone and the speed. And um, if you check my passport video out, you're going to see everything it does, it does, right? So you're going to want to know, should you get this or should you get the, cla the passport? Christian B., like I said, like I responded to you in the comments, it's all about if you can handle the size of the passport. If you are a bigger man with a with large hands and you can handle the size of the passport, you're not afraid of a little BBW Blackberry whiff. <laughs> See what I did there? Some BBW. If you're not afraid of a little Blackberry whiff, you know, it's a very wide phone. If you're not afraid of that, then it's definitely going to be the Blackberry Passport. For everybody rocking the 9900 or Q10 and you're not looking to break the bank and you want to, um, you know, you want something that's pocketable, something that you can hand. You want your phone to be your phone. You might have a tablet for social media and, and media and all that stuff. Then you can't go wrong with the BlackBerry Classic. I've talked too much. Reg Fox, if you know me. Star Fox, if you don't. Subscribe, comment, like, dislike. Don't beat me up too much, fellas, ladies. I know I've kind of was all over the place. I know I didn't really say much. I've been drinking. Um, but at the end of the day, it's not even about that. It's about I didn't really know what to say about it. The passport is the way to go if you like the latest, greatest, fast, and, and cannot be touched. Um, if you want something that's, you know, practical, then the classic is the way to go. For me, the classic will be my daily driver. But I will say, I don't necessarily feel as comfortable next to my boy who's pulling out the Galaxy Note 4 and his S Pen comes out. I felt good with the passport. I feel good if I have the passport coming out my suit jacket. I feel okay with the classic coming out, but I'm not going to talk any shit. I'm not going to talk shit with the classic. I'm not. I'm not. All right? Red Fox, if you know me, Star Fox, if you don't, have a happy and a safe. Let's get that money. Yeah, the chicken. We out.